All right, here we are. Riverbanks Outdoor Adventures. I'm fixing to test some rods that I've just bought, reels too. I have a <clears throat> Pawn Shop Rescue, a Daiwa GS9 with monofilament. I have a Saltus 500, 5000H with braided line. And I have a Saltus 5000, the newer model, with a St. Crow Mojo Surf. Now, <clears throat> the very first cast I did with the GS9 with the mono, it landed about halfway out in the pond. I strung a whole bunch of the string off and rewound it. And then I was able to cast clear across the pond. It landed on the bank on the other side. So what we're going to do is we're going to test the how far or how I'm just testing these rods and reels just to see how see how it works. I got my helper here, Drake. Drake, say hi. Hi. <clears throat> okay, we're going to go with the GS9 first. Casting the GS9. Also, may note that all these have two ounce uh, pyramid weights on them. I did that so it'd all be kind of accurate. Drake, watch yourself. Mono spun on here way too, way too thick. I can see right now I'm going to redo this one. Alright, here we go. It landed on the pond dam. Let me get some tight. My dog Belle, she's she likes to retrieve my lures. When I got this GS9, it wouldn't hardly spin at all. This thing works like a glove. I just got to put some new string on it. Yeah. Well, here the down. But now. Can I have my phone back, please? I, I'm going to show them what I'm collecting. Okay, okay. You can do it in a second. <laughs> this is going to be with the uh, Saltus 5000. Uh, a few years old and it's going to have a cunning rod it's a 10 foot same thing pyramid two ounce let's see how this goes. Dad, the one on the right is mine because i found them the one in the middle is for cordon the one on the left is some I actually probably, probably could have cast it over the dam, but it was, I had my fingers cut by braid before. We may redo this one with a finger guard. Braid will get you. Okay, we're going to be casting the uh, Saltus 5000 with braided line on a cunning rod. It's 10, 10 foot. Same thing. Gonna have a pyramid two ounce. I cast it the first time without a finger guard, and uh, I bet I could have cast clear across the uh, the pond dam. We'll try it with a finger guard this time. Oh yeah. Like I said, this thing casts like a dream. It's my first, uh, second actual cast with this rod, or in real. Um, this was an eBay buy. I don't remember how much I paid for it. It works just as good as new. I mean, this, this is a great reel. Uh, look forward to catching a whole bunch of fish with this one. And this is the older Saltus 5000. Okay, maiden cast, 
have not cast this rod before. It's a Mojo Serve. I just got this for my birthday a week ago. It's got the Saltus 5000 on it with braid. This is a Daiwa 8 braid. So let's just see see how this one flies. I have no f idea how far that cast. It went probably another hundred feet, maybe, on the other side of where the other salt is hit. That that thing just kept going. It would not stop. It just flew. I'm really impressed with this uh, eight Daiwa eight braid. This is 20 pound test. I'm a little winded, so. This is how far it cast. It's, boy, it sucker sang. It just flew through the air. Eight braids the way to go. Here it is up here, hung up in this bush. I gotta get it out. Okay, I got it reeled back in. Now. That was a very good cast and I wasn't doing a pendulum cast or a Hatteras cast or anything like that. I was just doing a you know standard just a backwoods Lake Texoma Oklahoma cast just to cast your line out I mean nothing special but that braid line at eight braid I actually expected the uh, the mono to do I mean it did okay it cast clear across it's a longer rod. It's nice. It's uh, here. You can see, kind of get an idea. This one's nine. That one's ten. This one here is probably eleven, uh, maybe eleven and a half. So there you go. I mean, that's a really good test. Got put. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna put on the the gold. I, I may go back with some mono, but now that I've got the feel for that. That eight braid, that Daiwa J braid, 20 pound, boy, that sucker sings. I, I'm going to recommend it. Oh, it just kept going. It was amazing. Anyway, Riverbanks Adventures, Southern Oklahoma. Talk to you later.